Hi guys, Nick here. Going to New York today, mega bucket list uh, destination in my life. Been uh, hoping to uh, get this trip organized for a few years now. Had a chance 10 years ago, but it didn't quite happen. So absolutely uh, stoked, as they say down under, to uh, get out there finally, going on Virgin Airways, and we'll give you an update, maybe during the trip, but uh, before the trip, but certainly during. We're gonna do a couple of little clips that I think will be quite interesting. Hi guys, we're on the way to the airport. Yellow suitcase and fiance in tow. So, the club we're gonna be uh, training at actually overlooks Central Park. So, um, I think we're gonna feel a little bit like Donald Trump there for a few days. <laughs> and uh, we're gonna, we've got about a 20 stop whistle tour organized with all the sites, etc. on a limited time off. And we're gonna, I'm gonna try and go into Brooklyn anyway and find someone to tell, forget about it. So my fiance just said she's so excited she's about to faint. I think I am as well. See you in New York or on the plane. I've been told that if I misbehave, that this is my dog house. Would I ever misbehave, sweetie? Yeah, of course. Never. All the time. Never. Especially when it comes to spending money. I always behave. So we're in the airport and just about to get on the plane. Looking forward to it. Look at that. I'm a virgin virgin, so it's going to be great to test out Virgin Atlantic, see the quality of their service and what Richard Branson has done. See you in New York. What a beast, the 747. And who know, whoever knew that they have swimming pools in airports? Right, we're on the way. Here's the swimming pool from the, uh, there's the swimming pool again from the plane's point of view. Anyway, uh, see you guys in New York. crossing the Hamptons, look. The Hamptons stretches all the way back there. Virgin Airways did a very good job, didn't they? See you in the club. It's Manhattan in the background. Just over the wing there, you can see Manhattan and the towers. We are now through customs. That was a bit frazzling, wasn't it? We're filming each other. Is that a selfie of a selfie? Anyway, we're in New York. This is our first taxi trip. See you in the club. Right, guys, we got off the plane, into the club. We're gonna show you a video on that tomorrow. But, someone's looking for a selfie stick. <laughs> Have a guess where we are. Where do you think we are? Clue, look at all the lights on the wall. I'm gonna turn around again, a little bit more, a little bit more. Now I think most of you can tell where we are. A few rices over here. But yeah, we're in Times Square, unbelievable. Absolutely superb, as is the company. See you tomorrow, we've got a great video to show you about this incredible snooker room with a massive surprise at the end. See you then.
epic dance battle in City Hall, New York. Brooklyn Bridge. And Brooklyn Bridge. Right, hi guys. We are in the New York Athletic Club and I want to show you a snooker room, Q sports room that is absolutely superb. Now have a look at this. This club started in 1886. Look at these snooker tables. Absolutely magnificent. This is Ahmed who runs the room. Pleasure. Say hello to YouTube. Hello, hello. And Ralph, my good friend. Howdy. So they've invited me over and uh, we're looking forward to four great days here together. And historic room, names on the wall from 130 years ago. But as I mentioned yesterday, I wanted to show you to you something absolutely incredible. The jewel on the crown of this snook room is this view, which is Central Park <clears throat> and the skyline of Manhattan. So if that's not enough to get your blood racing, there is no pulse. So we're going to have a great day. Signing off. See you later. See you all. Cheers, man. Thanks, Ralph, for inviting. Oh. See you later. Hi guys, we're up super early and uh, we've got something to show you. Now look at this. This is a sunrise, a bit of a special sunrise. Okay. By the way, the penthouse on that building is about a hundred million dollars. It's the building that had a crane hanging off it last year. But look at this sunrise overlooking Central Park. Now isn't that pretty amazing? Instead of looking at a grumpy old me this early morning, I'm going to leave you with this. Look at this lorry guys. One of the, one of the many incredible vehicles that we see in New York, along with the old fire trucks. See you soon, maybe got a couple more videos to show you. about you guys with that siren I always think of the 9-11 very sad sound anyway we're on Tesla corner one of the great heroes of history we're walking about 10 miles a day and uh, might give you some other interesting updates at some point in the next day or so. Cheers. Classic school bus. And look at this truck coming up. Never seen anything quite like it. I don't think that's heavy enough. 
Anyway, we're in Brooklyn now. Are we in Brooklyn no, or Queens? Queens? Queens. It's close, it's close. No, it's not. It's far, it's far. Uh, then Jamaica's quite close by. No, in Jamaica, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Jamaica, Queens. Um, then we're going to go to Freedom Tower, the, oyster, the Rockefeller, the Oyster Bar at Grand Central Station, Central Park, a few other bits and bobs. Forget about it! Hi, this is Nick. We're at Rockefeller Centre. This is Alfred. Hi! Say hi. What's up? <laughs> right, so I wanted to ask you something about New York. All right. Tell me about Forget About It. Forget about <laughs> it. Forget about it. It's good. It can be used in a good way or a bad way. So if you have tickets, have fun. Forget about it. And if you don't have tickets, you got to buy tickets. Forget about it. You got to buy tickets. It can be used any way you want. <laughs> got that? Forget about it. Forget about it. <laughs> Another bucket list location. Have a look, have a look, have a look. Famous movie scenes. Might actually have been this staircase, actually. Where that famous pram movie scene was taken. Look at this. That is amazing, isn't it? So is Grand Central Station. Fantastic building, absolutely beautiful. Anyway, we're going to take it in and see you at the next um, location. Welcome to One World Observatory. Hi guys, that was the lift that gets us up to the 102nd floor in the Freedom Tower in 60 seconds. This is a 360 degree view of the Manhattan or New York skyline. There's Manhattan over there, Central Park in the distance. And an incredible sunset on our last day in New York. I have a couple of other bits later on, but um, it's the end of a pretty compact uh, five days. So enjoy the view and come up here if you can from here in New York. Cheers. So we thought that sunset out of the 102nd floor was about the right time to draw to an end our video tour of New York. We've got back in one piece, absolutely exhausted. I stayed out of the doghouse most of the time, didn't I? Sweet. Most yeah. of the time. And we had an absolute blast. So bucket list uh, trip ticked off. We're going to speak to you soon. Keep watching the channel. Cheers.